Could you name me your top three films, so films you'd love to watch again and again and again? I really don't know. Top three. I do love Star Wars, actually. You should watch the zombie one, Pride and Prejudice and, and something zombies. It was, uh, I'm too drunk to be able to tell you right now, clearly. <laughs> Have you tried the Bird Box Challenge? I love The Godfather, Al Pacino. I'm a low-key Harry Potter fan. <laughs> so we are here at Carnaby Street with... Henry. Laura. And what do you guys do? We're both students. You're both, what are you studying? Uh, A-levels, so variety of things, both of us. Could you name me your top three films, so films you'd love to watch again and again and again? Gosh. Probably like a Marvel film. There's a lot of those. I say there's loads. Uh, oh no. I loved The New Thor. That was good. Ragnarok. Yeah, that yeah. one. I'm not sure. Have you got one? I'll tell you what, my three would be Good Will Hunting at the top, a bit of a classic, but I'm a big fan of that. Um, the recent Star is Born as well, which oh, I think good. might, is that nominated this year? Is it, it is, yes. Yeah, Cooper? yeah, love that. Yeah. And then lastly, Robin Williams, Dead Poet Society. Wow, that's an old one. So, yeah, that's yeah, a classic, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. I'm, yeah, I'm a fan of the classic. I'm Gavin and I'm from Southbank. I work a lot with startups, so growing new businesses. I'm Annie and I'm from Brighton. I'm a brand ambassador and event manager. How often do you watch movies? Quite Every a bit night. actually. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe maybe a couple of week. Not as often as he does. A few times a week, probably every other evening. Name top three movies. Gattaca. I really like Point Break actually, it's a classic. I quite like uh, Inception, that was very good. I really don't know, top three. I'll say Pulp Fiction. Love Actually. What's a favourite of mine? The Incredibles. <laughs> Oliver Ness. And? Millie Toussaint. I work for a specialist cleaning company. I look after horses. <laughs> wow, okay. What are your top three films? Top three oh films? Uh, what's the new one on Netflix? Is that the one with uh, Sandra Bullock? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The Bird Box. Bird, Bird Box. Box. Things brilliant. That's brilliant. We the Science that. of the Lambs. Um, not new. We like horror. We like horror. No, it's not new, but. But Bird uh, Box is. Bird Box is brilliant. Bird. Have you tried the Bird Box challenge? No. What is it? So the Bird Box challenge is that you have to blind yourself or yeah. put a blindfold yeah, yeah. on, and That's and then you have to go um, just day-to-day -day things. Yeah, yeah. She's done it. No, I don't either. I don't really don't idea. understand. No, I wouldn't be able to do it. I wouldn't be able to do it. Definitely not. Orla. And. Maha. And uh, what do you do, guys? Uh, I'm a fashion student in in here in London. Yep. Same. I'm a fashion student. Now, do you have uh, a, a top three films? Films that you'd watch over and over again? I mean, roughly, roughly. I love um, Kill Bill one and two. Wow. Okay. Does I that count as your two films, or is that just? I one? mean, I'm claiming them as one. I'm, okay, okay. Okay. You know, uh, Charlie's Angels and um, Tomb Raider, but the original. Wow. Wow. Quite the choice. We've not had some of those selections. We actually no. We. Quite old, I guess. Yeah. I guess they are. And what about you? Uh, so my first one would be Lucy, the sci-fi film. Like I love that film. That's my best. Um, I, to be fair, I don't know. I just love sci-fi. I'm not into horror or any other kind of... Uh, maybe Star Wars. I do love Star Wars, actually. I do like Star Wars. Which, 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 which episodes are your favourite? Uh, I'm, I'm not sure. So you're not a Star Wars... No, no, okay, no, no, okay. No, no, I'm not. But I okay. watch them like, with my dad and everything. I am Gianluca from Naples, Italy. I am Fabio from Naples, Italy. Italy. South Italy. And what do you do for a living? Why? <laughs> job, job, job. My job is a seller. Seller of industrial machine. Secretary of my friend. Name your top three movies. Uh, allora, El Padrino, The Good Father, Carlito Sway, and Napoli Spara, Camorra Risponde. Italian Mafia film. And for me, once upon a time uh, in uh, America, uh, Forrest Gump. And Titanic. <laughs> and uh, Notting Hill. Do you like uh, Fellini? Ah. Fellini. Federico Fellini. Ah, uh, so and so. Don't know. Um, not much. Right, so I am here with. Um, Vanessa. Carolina. And what do you guys do? I'm a student at UCL. I studied uh, design in the States. Wow, okay, great. Oh, in the States? Yeah. Wow, what brings you to London? Uh, just visiting. 
Okay. What are your favourite films? What films do you like to watch again and again? I haven't seen any of these recent films that are up for the Oscars, but my favourite film is Pride and Prejudice. <laughs> so that's like a film I watch all the time. Wow. <laughs> what did you, what did wow. you say? Pride and Prejudice. I haven't seen that. <laughs> Pride and Prejudice. Yeah. Have you seen the zombie one? No. Oh, you should watch the zombie one. Pride and Prejudice and, and something zombies. Yeah, it's it's great. It's really good. What about you? Uh, what a lot of like action comedy, like really dumb movies. Yeah. More of like a TV show person, but Harry Potter is always a good one. You can never not watch that. You know what I mean? It's it's a little bit of a classic now, isn't it? Harry Potter, the, especially the, the first ones. Yeah, and they're like coming out with a bunch of new things in the world, and it's kind of weird. Richard, London. Um, I'm a quantity surveyor. Do you watch movies? I do watch movies. Uh, not too often. But I, I like to go for like the action films or a bit of comedy. It just depends on what my mood is, really. Name your top three movies. Bronx Tale, City of God, and. Um, and belly, and belly, yes. Actually, kind of an honourable mention, um, paid in full as well, actually. Pikachu. Pikachu, wow. And what do you do, Pikachu? I'm a dentist. Do you, do you like films? I love films. Okay. Adore them. Could you name me your top three films? I think it would have to be, um, well, it'd have to be Star Wars. I think that. Which one? Ah, a very difficult question. Uh, it would have to be episode three. Okay, okay. It's controversial by itself. It is, it is, okay, okay, and uh, uh, the other two? It's, it's very difficult when you're drunk. Um, it's much easier when I'm sober. It would certainly be Galaxy Quest, I think, is, is one of my favorites. A uh, bit of fun, I don't think you all know what that is. You might want to look it up. Uh, fantastic fun. Um, and I think finally it would have to be perhaps Reservoir Dog, something classic that you could all relate to. Oh, okay, okay, wow, one of, um, one, of, uh, one, of, one of the first films for, um, for which director? It was, uh, oh, I'm too drunk to be able to tell you right now, clearly. <laughs> you, you, you have no idea we started at two o'clock in the afternoon. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Flory? And, uh, and, and what do you do, Flory? I'm a development manager for a social change consultancy. So your top three films? Forrest Gump. <laughs> Good choice. <laughs> the Fabulous Design of Amélie Poulain. Wow. Um, okay. And uh, Majestic Man. Yeah. Wow. wow, that is quite the selection. I would say that's quite exotic. I don't think I've heard I've heard a, a choice so diverse because one of the films is French. What's your favorite thing about it? Well, the one with Amélie, at least, it's really magical and different and cool, and it makes you reflect on a lot of stuff. Quite mysterious. So I don't know. Demi, Alicia, Kiki. I'm at school. I'm at school. I'm actually a student of psychology with the Open University. <laughs> Wow, okay, so you're all technically students. Right. Could you name me top three of your films that you'd like to watch again and again and again? Okay, I love The Godfather, Al Pacino. I'm more of a classic person. Breakfast at Tiffany's. Oh, yeah. Um, well, another one, another one. I think they're my top two. I can't, I don't know about that anymore. My favourite movie, well, both of ours, is The Wolf of Wall Street. Yeah. Featuring. That is a good choice. That is a good choice. Yes. Featuring Leonardo DiCaprio. Was the film an, uh, rated 18? Mitchell and Johnny. Um, what dancers? Moving on. Um, could you name me your top three most favourite films? Like films that you could watch again and again and again. That's a that's a very sticky one. For me, personally, I'm a I'm a low key Harry Potter fan. Yep, yep, low key Harry Potter. So. For me, I would watch Harry Potter quite a lot, like over and over again. Okay, which which parts are your uh, most favourite? Name three. Three parts. Ooh, um, okay, so the first one, because it, it gave like an intro to Harry and how he, what's it called, how he was living and so, and then um, what we'll say, I can say for second was towards the end where you could see the growth, like he's come from being that little boy to now he's facing Voldemort and what's not, and then um, one bit I did like was the, I always liked the Quidditch match because it was so, it was very interesting like how they fought about it and everything. So it was just one of those ones. Okay, yeah. thank you, thank you. And what about you? Um, see that's the thing, I can't, I can't think of three off head but I know Speed is one of them, yeah? Mm. Um, so Speed, I'm going to say just because these are off the top of my head, Die Hard and Rush Hour, three. Ooh. Yeah. Rush. All right, good choice, good choice. We've not. But the first one got me. Yeah. 
Okay. I'm Raquel. I'm from China. Our Sam from Nepal. I'm student. We all student. We're yeah, from we're the student. same college. What are you studying? Uh, fashion. Okay. Name top three your movies. Titanic. Titanic. Yeah. Avengers. The Avengers. Aquaman. Top three movies. Uh, Deadpool, Finding Nemo, and um, Forrest Gump. Lily. And what do you do, Lily? I'm a film student. So could you name me, since you're a film student as well, no pressure there, um, could you name me your top three films? My top three films? Uh, Cinema Paradiso, okay. which is an Italian old film, but which I really like. The Breakfast Club, which I'm aware is not objectively that good, but I have a really... Classic. It's a classic. Yeah. I really like yeah. it. And I should have this more thought through. I know people that can say that top 20 list by heart, but I just, there's just some films that I really like. Okay, excellent, excellent. That's, that's a good choice. Those are the two films that we've, actually, we, we had Breakfast Club earlier today. So it's a good film. It's a good film. If more than one person is putting it in their top three, it must be a great film. Chris Saunders. And what do you do, Chris? Uh, I'm a student in America doing my master's. And what are you studying? Uh, master's of management. Do you like films? Um, yeah, I do like I like okay. movies. Yeah. So give me your top three films. Uh, I've just watched Bohemian Rhapsody, and I thought that was phenomenal. Um, being from Africa, I like Blood Diamond, um, and then I'd say Pearl Harbor number three. Yeah. Wow, quite the choice. We've not had that before <laughs> today. Yeah. My name is Chloe, and I'm from China, and I'm currently studying the University of Warwick. Yeah. Uh, my name is. Chris and I'm here for my graduation ceremony. Yeah, now living in China. Name your top three movies. Okay, I wonder one, I wonder three, I wonder two, and I wonder three. Yeah, it's my top three. I like all the movies from Benedict's Cumberbatch, like all the Sherlock movies series. Yeah. Siri male fernut era di macusi. Evitiamo stasera di finire nel letto. Si rimane fornuto, ma che sfizio c'è